Hi guys, before this video gets started, I want to start out by saying that I'm sorry if I sound gross in this video. I have COVID, but I really wanted to get the video out because I didn't want to make anyone wait any longer. So here it is. I forgot to take a before picture, so here's a picture I found off the internet. I'm going to start out by putting some lips over her open smile and putting some clay over her feet for her shoes and then sanding that down with fine grains of sandpaper so it blends in with the plastic. Then I'm going to start putting thin coats of paint over her whole body. I'm using thin coats so as to not show any brush strokes. After all that's dry, I'm going to put on a few layers of Liquitex gloss varnish. I forgot to do this till the end, but I'm going to put it here anyway. I painted her feet black and also put on a few coats of Liquitex gloss varnish on them too. I'm going to be dusting on a lot of chalk pastel for her cheeks, as well as painting on her eyebrows and eyelashes. I know she has much fuller eyelashes than that, but I got very cowardly, and I mixed up paint for her lips. I wasn't able to remove the head, so I also wasn't able to remove the plugs, so I just glued over them. And I know you're not supposed to use hot glue, but I did here because it was the only thing that would work. doing one side, I tied it up so it would be out of the way while I do the other side. Now these are very pathetic compared to what she has in game, so I'm gonna fix that. I'm using a very thick yarn for her hair, 
So I just take equal lengths of it and then split it twice. To stick on her new pigtails, I'm going to snip off the old ones, seal that with hot glue, and then stick the new ones on. I'm sorry about the terrible lighting. I tried to fix it as best I could, but I might have made it worse. After all of the hair is secure, I'm going to stick on her ribbons and bows in her hair. Use this pattern to make her petticoat, and then cut out two fabric pieces that look like this. Her dress is very poofy, so I take rectangles of tulle and gather them up and then sew them on the dress in rows. For her actual dress, I measured up these pieces. To test them out, I used this spare purple fabric that I had lying around and it turned out great. So I also made a copy of that out of the blue and then added all of the ribbons and bows onto it.
After sticking on the last bow onto her front, she's done. I hope you guys enjoyed the video. I'm sorry again if my voice sounds absolutely terrible. Uh, if you liked the video, make sure to subscribe. See ya!